what's up everyone welcome back to another video today we're gonna be making another update to the elevator because we added a lot of changes to it so i would love to show you guys some so uh let's not waste any time getting into the video so yeah i think it's this oh yeah this is sorry but you open to your game right you all have all this right okay sorry about the lag but you have this remember we deleted the previous tune sting and like added back the new one and after that you should you should open up to your game and you should get this like before so for for the this twisted i already i have like an updated version of it with the kit so we're, you're just gonna delete that I don't know why. I don't know why, but like it's my my recording is a little bit laggy. It's in my lag sometimes. I don't know what's up with that, but yeah. So you, you I guess you could say you can ruin everything that we made from the last part. Um, the reason why I made you code the last part is because I want you to have an understanding of what's gonna happen for the elevator. But this one, like I said, like I like I said before, it'll take too long. Probably like an hour to like modify and add. So. We added that. You might remember that. Uh, also, the values is like is also a different story too. It will say a group. So you want to delete the floors because we already have the pre-made ones. It's also the elevator script, but keep the main UI and others. So go to replicate storage. You see enemies and floors. First, let's check out the floors. So you can see if you go through the floors, you can see there's something new called enemy spawns. This looks very new to you. Because it is new. So, so these are the spawns that our enemies are going to go. So you can see. Yeah. And enemies are going to be in here. I have all these. I took them on, off the the, um, the the toolbox. So I wouldn't recommend using them for your game. But um, pretty, they're official. So I'm pretty sure it's fine. But. You got all these free characters. So this is just a main. Or not main. Just like regular. Uh, I guess I could say this is a regular, and let's just say this is a main. And, uh, let's just say you want your main to appear on floor 10. Like, sort of like how Bassy works. So, add two of these, uh, configs in each of these characters. Make sure they have a chaser, which has all these, by the way. Make sure it has an animation thing, which you can put all your animations in. And a config, which is a new something new. And a chance is like 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 what percent chance you can get for the thing. For me, it's hundred percent just for the tutorial. Floor requirement is the it's the requirement for the floor for the twisted to be able to go in. Like let's just say it's a it's a bassy. Let's just say like for like for the bassy, it won't spawn until like four fifteen. Well, it could spawn four or five, but that's like the boosting. Oh yeah. But you can see, yeah. The chance is clearly explain explanatory. And probably the next time when we go to twists again, we might add footsteps, sort of like how like different uh ones be like. So yeah, so like this guy will have some footsteps, additional ones. Yeah, sorry, get a little distracted. Um, but remember, like before, this is a replicated storage. So take this both, put them in replicated storage. And we got server storage, which is the elevator script. You can see some updated stuff, like a lot of updated stuff. Like, what is this? Get enemies to spawn. So basically, this is like how much enemies you can have per floor. Like, like not per floor, but like, let's just say right here, floor 15. Like, if it's like that.
Oh my gosh, guys, I'm so sorry, but I didn't realize I had my uh my thing uh my my mic disabled. I I don't know what part we left off that I on my mic muted, but I just said like collisions group. Uh, this is list view. Um, yeah, these I have to learn to not uh, mess up on that. Oops. <laughs> and um, we got table view, which is like old school way. Well, not really old school way, but like just pretty old to use but that's how you set up the collisions group i'm so sorry i did not i did not realize i had that on but i had it off, yeah, my mic off but if just in case if i did not say it uh this is like how much floor is like like like, like how much floor like what floor or up what mean which means uh like if it's five or more it could have two twisted as ones but for for testing purposes we're gonna have one floor with three at a time It'll just go on, go on. It's it's just free. And then it just no goes on, goes on. It's a pretty long script, but it's not as much as uh tw yeah. So now let's just run it real quick instead of actually playing it. So let's wait for the game to load because it takes like ten seconds for the game to actually load. There, it's set up like that. So. Yeah, spawn. The reason why I sp 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 spawn so quickly because, uh, before if you didn't know, like if I had my mic muted, um, I had it to one second for like the, for like the uh, what do you call, it? the countdown timer. And then for the round timer, I set that up also. But you could notice that they're all like going through each other, which is something we do want. You see this orange room. You see we're on floor two. Free sheepies. You see, they go they go through together, because back then, uh, they would uh kind of collide with each other, which is something that we didn't want before, but it's all fixed now. And they should attack you like usual. All right, we're on floor free. Floor, okay. We got more sheepies. Yeah, we got that. Now, yeah. Now, well, so on, so on. Yeah, this could take a real while because uh, it's kind of annoying. Alright, so floor 5 should be the part where floor starts to spawn. I'm pretty sure she should spawn because uh, her rarity chances are like uh, 100%. So yeah, we got her now. But obviously you could change this to like whatever chance you, or you want it to be so you can see it works fine. So yeah, that works. So like, also just in case if I didn't have my mic uh, muted before. The countdown time is like how long it takes to prepare, generate, etc. for voice. Round timer for how long you could be in there. Save time is like how long you could you could it takes for you to get back. And such as such as such. You can make twists as fast. Anything you want, basically. But I just wanna say Thanks for watching this video. Join the Discord down below for updates and, and such for this stuff. But this was kind of a wild day because uh, we we had like player setup, which is what it looks like here. And um, if you like one more videos of this, um, just hit that subscribe button to get notified when another video is uh, is hit. So uh, see y'all in the next one. Bye.